Welcome back. This is Nalex homework video on calculating standard reaction free energy from free from standard free energies of formation. So nice straightforward problem. If you have uh, all gases at one atmosphere and you have all uh, concentrated solutions at one molar concentrations, then there is a big table of the energy that's available to do work with, and that's called the Gibbs free energy. It's the big G. Uh, and when you are trying to find a standard uh, reaction free energy, it's absolutely easy. You'll like this. Okay, so the first thing I did is looked up the table, and in this case, I've got a peroxide um, reacting with lead sulfide, and I have the reactant. Uh, uh, compounds and the product compounds and then the reaction is going to be the the reactants uh, the products minus the reactants and each of the products times the uh, number of moles of each okay so that's that's it that's the entire uh, problem so I'm going to do the products first so I have uh, the 813 which is uh, the lead sulfate and that's negative 813 kilojoules per mole. Then I have four moles of the water, each at negative 237.1 kilojoules. Add those together, and I get an answer. That's in kilojoules. And then here's my second one. This, this is my reactants. I have four moles of the, of the peroxide and one mole of the lead sulfide, and I add those together. Now all I'm going to do is subtract the reactants from the products. So my standard, that's what the, the little zero is, is the standard uh, uh, free energy of formation, uh, when I put it together, is 1181 kilojoules. And so, nice. I'm glad for at least for one easy problem from Alex.